Bahamas judo team recently returned from Mexico City. There they were successful in obtaining two medals, a silver and a bronze, the first ever for the Bahamas. Very proud judo mama this very moment. Um, to know that Nathan went out there, he did his best, and to know that he won a medal, that is the highlight of my life right now in his 13 years of being my child. The star of the team was silver medalist Taryn Butler. Her mother had this to say about the event. I am very, very proud of her. I am, I, it, I can't even put it into the words how much the effort and energy and the training that, that to just to see the results of it. And that's all that it boils into, hard work, training and discipline and going out there and being fierce with it. So I'm very proud of her, I'm very proud of the team and I can't wait to see what else is to come. Okay, uh, I am the president of the Puerto Rico Judo Federation. So we are very happy because the Bahama uh, got a very strong, uh, very strong team. So uh, very good, very good competition. So for the next year, we'll be all the country from the P, from the Pan American will be in the Bahama in February for the tournament. All the people from the, the Central America and the Caribbean, we are very happy with the, the job, the judo job in Bahama. Judo is a sport that can even be appreciated by the grandparents. Here's Nathan's grandfather. I feel that any parent should be very proud of their child. Uh, parents should more take more uh, part in their children's act activities, uh, not only school, but also physically. And I think this is goes to show the Bahamians what Bahamians can do. All right, the team is back. We have two medals at one of the most prestigious tournaments you can imagine in this part of the world, in South America, with the best of the best. And we got two medals in three fifth places. Couldn't ask for anything more. The experience that they would have gathered from this is going to be tremendous, and we will see it coming up in February, and every tournament after that we will see it. Excellent. The kids were treated to an amusement park, and everybody had a great time learning about the culture of Mexico.